we use the facial wash, which also can be used as a exfoliant as well. And I will show you the consistency of it. It's the dual purpose, isn't it? Yeah. Cleanser. So it's like the exfoliant. a balm, which you work into the skin. Obviously, if you're just using it as a cleanser, you would add water to this, so it becomes, you know, creamy and rich. And then obviously if you're using it as an exfoliant, you probably wouldn't use as much water. And you can see the consistency is quite nice and rich. I so can see it around do here. A light cleanse for her. And with this cleanser, you do need to apply water or else you find that it will drag the skin a little. So make sure you apply enough water it's to the skin. For people at home, it's best to literally splash your face with mm -hmm. warm water and then apply a very small amount of the cleanser. From your perspective as a cleanser, I love this product. The cleanser has got a slight exfoliant, which is ground loofah, so it's very gentle on the skin, but at the same time, it has the ability to remove dead skin cells. Mm -hmm. And that way, then all the ingredients in the other products that have benefits can penetrate into the skin much deeper. And with this cleanser, you don't actually need to rub it into the skin. You just want to get any excess kind of oil or makeup off the skin and then you can take it off with a warm flannel or damp, right. damp cotton pads. Mm -hmm. So you shouldn't actually be dragging the skin with the cleanser. I'm just going to take it off for Lauren now. How does it feel, Lauren? It's really nice. It smells very refreshing mm -hmm. and it feels really cool on your skin. It has basil, fennel and juniper in the fragrance essential oils and they are very good for cleansing and removing bacteria. The crystal within the cleanser at the same time has a way of moisturizing the skin even though you are cleansing it it's not leaving the skin tight and taut. You know how sometimes a lot of cleansers cleanser, using yeah. water feel that way? We're just taking any excess oil off the skin. Let me feel now. Yes, lovely. Here we have our toner, which we use as a spritz over the skin, which is very light, as you can see, so it's not heavy. And this is a brilliant multi-purpose product, and that can be placed on top of makeup to give it a radiant sheen yeah. or underneath your foundation or underneath your day cream, yeah. night serum. And I use it as well in the summer if I'm quite hot and, you know, my yes, face as a is refresher. quite, just as a refresher, just a nice spritz and go, you don't have to take it off or anything, you can just leave it on and it's, and it's great. Do you use the spritzer I do. Um, yeah. out of the, the sort of working environment? Definitely. I it's use really it. Good in the summer. I love it's it in the fabulous summer. in the summer. It's really great for when you're traveling, especially when you're locked on, on airplanes where there's no air. Mm -hmm. This is something that you could use, Lauren, on your skin because you have a tendency to be dry on mm -hmm. your skin. I'd say someone who's got slightly oily skin, but not, you know, you can definitely use it in the summer as well, just to calm the skin down if it gets quite hot. See, that lovely. The, the crystal balances the skin, so it prompts the skin to basically go into self-repair. So you could use it even if you have a dry skin or if you have um, an overactive sebaceous gland mm -hmm. type of skin. Then we have our day and our night cream. The day cream has got the crystals, the minerals and trace elements, but it also has free radical scavengers, protection against the UVA environmental damage. It has vitamin E and gets absorbed really, really quickly into the skin. It'll, your skin will literally suck it in. Yeah. It feels fabulous, let me. And it absorbs yes, very, it's wonderful. very easily mm. as well. So if, for instance, someone is doing the facial at home and it's at night time, mm -hmm they would put the night serum on, mm -hmm. which would also trap the essential oils within the facial oil and really replenish the skin's moisture level Absolutely. during the night. But if you're doing the facial in the daytime, you would put the day cream. And the day cream has got, of course, the, the crystal with all the minerals and trace elements, but it also has, it's not an SPF, it protects the skin from the damage of UVA rays, which is really the first part of creating inflammation in the skin. Mm -hmm. People don't seem to know that uh, actually it's so important to protect your skin from free environmental mm -hmm. damage. Absolutely. And yes, it's got free radical scavengers in there, so they come and eat up all the toxicity in the skin. It goes on really well, you know, you, you start off applying 
the forehead and then work around the eyes, the nose and the mouth. And that again, I've found, it gets really absorbed quickly yeah. and you don't have a, a layer of sheen yeah. uh, or shine, should I say. I mean, I've put the... quite a bit on her skin because her skin's mm. quite dehydrated and there's no shininess there at all. I mean, she could step out now without any makeup yes. and it doesn't look as if she's had a facial or Yes, how or does anything. it feel, Lauren? feels really good. It's, it is different than the... The serum, the, yeah, yes. Yeah. The serum is, is literally like a silk layer mm -hmm. going onto your skin, whereas this is actually, it, it penetrates more. Mm, your skin looks fabulous. <laughs> now it's my turn. <laughs> and now we're going to show you the night serum. It's so silky and yeah. smooth, really, really silky and smooth. You don't need to rub it in yeah. too much because it just gets absorbed into the skin immediately mm -hmm. on placing. And you don't need that much either. So it goes in very, very well. We would apply either a day or night cream depending. Depending on the need of the skin. Yeah. If your skin is in need of super boost of minerals, trace elements and moisture, you would put the night serum. And then you put very little on, you massage a little bit, wouldn't you say? You massage yeah. a little bit around the face? I'd say someone who's probably got either sun damaged skin or if someone's really worried about aging process or if their skin is really drying it's a double action so you have the serum along with the night cream as well. And also it has other ingredients apart from the crystal with the minerals and the trace elements it has other ingredients that are very good for releasing tension in the muscles which is like a natural Botox except it's very gentle it's low low in plexa the ingredients very good when you place it around here because that's mm -hmm. where most of our tension, tension. comes from yeah. now it doesn't tingle but it feels it's cool and smooth it doesn't feel like it's like silk, isn't mm, it? Yes, yeah. there's a silkiness to it. There we go. Feels great. Yeah, and your, <laughs> your skin, skin looks super clean. And, I'm and super, you are. you're rehydrated <laughs> and you are radiant. Oh, thank you. <laughs>